Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My brothers and sisters, when people will be going into hellfire, they will be going in groups. These groups, there are various explanations of who they will be. There is an entire surah named after the groups. That is Surat Az-Zumar in the Quran. Allah says, وَسِيقَ الَّذِينَ كَفَرُوا إِلَىٰ جَهَنَّمَ زُمَرًا The disbelievers will be driven to hellfire in groups. It is reported that these groups are those whom they were with on earth and those whom they followed. So those who followed each other and those who spent time misguiding each other or following the misguidance without questioning it, they would be together, bungled together and driven to the, the worst of places together. Now, what we learn from this is obviously the Almighty wants us to ask every time, ensuring that what we're doing is the right thing. So don't be shy to question, to ask in order to seek knowledge, in order to learn, in order to know. In this way, you will be able to verify the information you have, the knowledge that you have to follow that which is accurate, that which is authentic, and not just to follow people who are calling you towards anything and everything. Not everything you hear out there is correct. Not everything you hear out there is pleasing to Allah Almighty. In fact, as the days are passing and we are drawing closer to the end of times, you need to know that bad will increase and good will decrease. If this is the case, then surely we need to be much more careful whom we interact with, whom we learn from, what we learn. And even sometimes the good people can make mistakes. So if you have a inquisitive mind, you will be able to differentiate by the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala between that which is inaccurate, that which is accurate. Remember, when you team up with people in this world, probably you will be in the same team in the hereafter. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.